All right, so we are preparing for an IEP meeting and we know we've got the meeting coming up in the next couple of weeks, maybe even a couple months, and we want to be as prepared as possible for this meeting. One of the great tools that we have and we've discussed in an earlier recording or two is the ability to record with our devices, whether that's with your computer or with your smartphone, even an iPad. So one of the great ideas is to have video evidence for your IEP meetings. And so you can look at things like gross motor skills, socialization skills, locomotor skills. One thing that you want to keep in mind is it's a very powerful tool to have that video evidence, but you want to also make sure that you have the standard or the rubrics to go with whatever learning is being done in the gym. So collect your evidence, but also bring to the table your standards and your rubrics, what you're using. This is going to be so important to have. That way you're not fumbling through when a parent or another colleague asks you, well, what, what does the standard say? You've got it. You've got your rubric, what constitutes maybe if you're on a one to four scale and all that is in an effort to help drive the goal process for this individual student, what this student is currently working on and where this student needs to get to based on the recommendations of the IEP meeting and team. So there you go. Do your recordings. It's awesome and it's very powerful, but also bring to the table your standards and your rubrics.